Among the pending bills scheduled to be scrapped from the 19th Parliament are a set of labor reform bills. Korea's labor minister, however, says he will work to push for re legislation of the bills for the sake of the country's labor conditions. Shin Zemin Min tells us more. Korea's labor minister, Lee Gi Kwon, says he will push for legislation of a package of labor reform bills in the upcoming 20th National Assembly. Calling it a regrettable reality that many young Koreans are unable to find jobs, the minister said the political circles should share the burden of responsibility. Reintroduction of the labor reform bills in parliament will be a priority once the 20th National Assembly opens. The set of labor reform bills include labor standards, employment insurance benefits, compensation for industrial mishaps, and contract terms for non-regular workers. The labor minister cited that the youth unemployment figure rose 100,000 in just six months after the labor reform agreements made by the tripartite committee in September last year, and said that unless there is a push for reform, that number will rise even more pushing the nation's sons and daughters into a corner. In regards to the ongoing corporate restructuring of the country's shipbuilding and shipping industries, the minister said that government should shoulder responsibility and support laid-off workers by helping them gain reemployment to secure their livelihoods. He stressed the need to push for legislation of labor reform bills as they include support measures for corporate restructuring, which could provide the greatest benefit for employees from the shakeup. Shin Zemin, Arirang News.